Well, welcome everybody to CCTV. I'm going to put this up here today. It's just kind of mind-blowing. Yeah, you were just looking at like two light sources, right? The one on the right there, on the upper right, I think we're looking at a, a two. It covers the whole sky. And there's a lot going on there. And here's one of my channel. We turn the music down, set it up. I started out with a filter because we're in a filtering show, so I'm starting out with filters to show you what's up. Now see, all these filters, lens squares, are created to hide the white on the tip side on the right there coming in. So I just got a whole slew of stuff to show you. Uh, I'm going to do back and forth music narration, how's everybody doing? Uh, hope I didn't freak too many out on the last video, my intense truth video. Anyways, if you haven't watched it, look for the uh, link in the chat. What's up, everybody? What's up, Pierce? Frank? Sarah? Everybody's in here. Wow. Douglas, what's up, everybody? Now, this right here, guys, check it out. This right here is two UFOs. I don't usually catch footage like this, but since I did, I showed you the other three in the beginning of the video. These are similar, they're moving through the atmosphere. I mean they are, they're moving. So don't be surprised, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you some cities in the sky, and I'm gonna deep cloud, and you guys get ready. It's all on like a bomb. So UFOs, keep watching. I'll be back.
Well, good morning, everybody. Now, let's get weird. I'm going to do a deep cloud. Uh, but I'm going to deep cloud what I think is a movie shot of the opposite. Let's check it out. Cities in the sky. Did you ever hear of those? So my eraser, I'm able to erase and whatever's originally behind whatever they're covering. Let's say they're using like a blue beam Photoshop on the nano skies. And notice that object. Notice that object. There's an object there. There's an object there and an object there. Now we've been thinking, oh, that's just lens flares, Chris. It's just lens flares, right? Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to decloud this. I started seeing this, and I told my wife, oh crap, what is that? And I started undoing it, and look what I found, guys. I take my time to digest what I'm doing. So I take my declouder, I call it declouder, and I begin to do one piece at a time. Uncover what's there. I'm going, that don't make sense. I thought it was going to be a green plant, right? So no, it's not a green plant. It's better. Better, better, better. Gail, are you watching? Gail loves this when I decloud something. I only do it on stuff that's really good. Now this is just tripped me out. I took part of that building. I erased part of that building. I'll bring it back, I think. If it's real... Um, you see how there's a peri periwinkle blue? That's actually the real color of the sky right there. And what it's doing is like, I'm really thinking there is nano skies where they're just projecting whatever they want. So we've been watching these for three years, four years. And I've un-declouded un un Hotel Hell, and I call it an Anunnaki Hotel. But look at this, is like, this is like a piece of land that has some kind of power source in the middle, like a star in the middle of it generating it. I mean, it's got to have some major power sources. This is a piece of land with buildings on it. It's blowing my mind. You know, I don't know, guys. I'm just making a show. But it's a good show. So let's do this other one. We've seen these for years. Like, I know, at least I've been seeing these. They're getting more distinct, right? So I said, let's just keep uncovering. And look what I found on this one. It's like another city far back. It's a smaller city. Same thing. Now, how can it reveal that, right? That's not the, that's not the uh, texture of the canvas in the video at all. And the light of blue, like I was saying, I think the light of blue is the actual real color of the sky. But they overlay it with this weird stuff. So what's really going on? I don't know. You got me. I don't know. Look at that. That's on there, right? I'm going to go backwards on it. Real fast. This is what we've been seeing. Now, I don't know any facts on this. Is this what we're really uncovering? Let's go back. Oh. Okay. You can't uncover something that's not there. Because you see the light blue is what it, what's really back there. So if the light blue is the real sky, then that building's with that stone foundation. It's just gravity. It's just like floating city in the sky, right? I don't know, guys. This stuff makes you crazy doing it, right? So I'm going to go backwards real fast. Yeah, cities in the skies, people. Are they hiding cities in the skies? You tell me. Just watch. This is just a program. Anybody can buy the program. It's an eraser program. Here we go. I'm going to start racing. I'm going to do it quickly. Watch it form. Buildings. It's a nuts. It's crazy. Now watch. They cover up really good. See? Those are the tops of the buildings that are on that floating city. What? Alright. I'm just having fun. I'm not saying it's perfect science here, but you got me. I don't know. It looks like another one up there, same, same build. And I've seen these in Canada fly by over and over. So what's this right here? Could that be Mars or Venus or something? And up here, this could be Venus or Mars. I don't know. But right here, there's another one. It's right in front of the sun. Let me show you. 
Now watch what we do here. I'm gonna declout this. Okay guys, I'm going to do another one of these pictures, different angle, different size, and I've been wondering, I've never thought about declouding them, but this is what we're getting, uh, they're like atmospheres around this round uh, sister sun, it looks like, this one, but are these just energy sources for these hotels? I have no proof of the blue but I'm going to research it pretty hard. Um, this looks like a door to have. <laughs> Look at that, it's like a building with a door, but uh, let's see the doorway in heaven. Thank you. 